Hey everyone, Lee Ferrata this Binary here. This is the last week before Halloween, so happy early Halloween from me. I thought I would be a little spooky and totally extra in my video this week because it's totally my style. And my lighting is so bad. I'm so sorry. So this week's topic is gender segregated spaces. Now really the only gen the only gender segregated spaces that I have experience with is really in school, so that sucks because everything's divided into girls and boys. And I'm left not knowing what to do with myself, so that's fun, but I'm sure most of us know about how school operates in terms of the gender binary and enforcing that onto literally everything, so I won't talk too much about that. But then there's things like, there's things like support groups, mainly like support groups for women, tend to be mainly marketed towards cis women, and also like, I don't know, like from any kind of first-hand knowledge or first-hand account of anything. Uh, but I would imagine that trans women may not, very potentially, do not have as much acceptance in those, like, support groups and things, because they're not real women, at least according to cis people. So that kind of sucks, in fact that really sucks, but mm, transphobia, yay! In terms of non-binary genders, I, they don't even play a part in gender segregation because it's always splitting everything into the binary genders. Everything is always split into these two options and it doesn't make any sense. And us non-binary people are left completely forgotten about. Completely. Entirely left out of everything. I'm sure we're all used to that by now though. Honestly, I don't really know what to talk about in this video. I got very carried away with the spoopy setup and really bad lighting to think about the actual content of this video. But I don't know, I don't feel as if I would have much to say about it anyway. Because I've always. I always kind of just accepted the fact that everything is split into male and female and that I don't fit into those things and I've always been the kind of person in this respect to just face that problem once I get to it. I'm not like that for a lot of other things, in fact most other things, but for this in particular it's just like it's too much to deal with because it's so ingrained into everything that society has ever taught us as people. So I figure I just deal with those specific issues as I come to them. So I don't really have much to say on this topic other than like school really sucks because of this segregation of binary genders and leaving. Not very people just on the sidelines, not even considering that we might exist. And like, yeah, support groups and things. Not accepting trans people of that gender. Obviously, it's all entirely ridiculous and it shouldn't be a thing. And we should all, all genders should just be treated the same and should not be divided in terms of anything, because honestly, I don't really see how that accomplishes anything. Like, what benefit does it have to us as people to split things, to divide us into groups based on our gender, even though not all of us identify with the groups that we are split into? And we're not always accepted into those groups if we even if we do identify as those things. So I don't know. I really don't know. I don't understand. I don't get it. 
I don't understand. I think I might just leave it there because I don't really know what I'm talking about. So I hope you have a very spooky Halloween this weekend and I hope your day is as beautiful as you are. Bye! I'll get you my pretty and your little dog too.